Hi guys, it's Emily. Welcome back to my channel. I had a couple requests um, after the the hop video um, where I made this um, this pocket here. I had some requests about how to make the the base pocket. Now, I did link to um, Pam at the Paper Outpost because that's how I learned how to make this. Um, but I thought, you know what, I'll just go ahead and show you as well. And I will link again to Pam because this was not my idea and I don't wanna take credit for it at all. Um, also, um, I'm just gonna link to Pam's channel um, below this time because she has just a ton of amazing ideas um, in general. And then she has a whole playlist of many, many videos about how to use up your book pages. <clears throat> Excuse me. And this is just one of the many ways. So I'll go ahead and show you, but just please remember that this was not my idea. Um, and go check Pam out, okay? All right, it's super easy. So you need a book page, any book page will do. Um, you don't have to do anything to it. Very simple. First, you wanna take this bottom left corner, okay? And you wanna fold it up so that you make a uh, right angle, you know, 90 degree angle-ish here. Not, not the end of the world if it's not perfect, okay? So you wanna fold that down. So now you have this shape, okay? And then you wanna take this side and this side and you're gonna fold them at the same time and you want to overlap them um, and you just wanna kinda of eyeball, you know, this is actually gonna go inside. So you can do it that, you can just fold it that way. I think that's how Pam does it. Until you get a shape, you know, that you're happy with. All right, and then you'll just Go ahead and fold down the sides. Super easy. The only thing left to do is um, add some glue to the bottom to kind of hold everything together. And there you go. You have a quadruple pocket and you can add, or it, it could even be a five pocket pocket, um, depending on how you clue it down. Um, but yeah, Pam, I think originally uh, called it a quadruple pocket. So that's what I'm going to call it. So we can get at least four things in here. But obviously, you know, you can load it up with as many things as you would like. So yeah, there you go. Super easy, right? Okay, so let's go ahead and do it again, just in case it wasn't terribly clear the first time. This is just a um, page from a, an Emily Post etiquette book. Um, that's what it is. Uh, so yeah, all right. So bottom left corner, and we're gonna take it up this way, all right, until we make, you know, sort of a right angle. Doesn't have to be perfect, right? like so. Then you have this shape. So you want your fold facing you. All right. You're going to take this side and this side and bring them together. And you're going to tuck your left side into that little right side. It doesn't have to go very far. Just a little bit. Just enough to stay. Okay. Like that. And then you're going to fold down your sides. Now the way I did that, you have a lot of blank space, but obviously you can, you know, like I did, um, you can decorate these up in any number of ways. All right, so we'll add our glue. All right, just to hold everything together. All right, now I wanna show you an easy way to ink this up. Um, because you can't do it ahead of time, really. Um, I mean, you could, but you might not get, you know, ink everywhere that you want it. So I'm going to do it on the other one because it's drier. You'll need your pocket. 
and some ink. Oh, that was very squeaky. I am very sorry. This glass mat takes some getting used to. And then just a piece of scrap paper, okay? Super simple. You wanna tuck your scrap paper all the way in to your pockets. And then you can just ink that up without worry of getting ink other places where you don't want it. And then, um, let's see, hold on, this is too, too big. Why am I struggling? Okay, there we go. <laughs> Why am I struggling? Cause that's what I do. All right, here we go, that one done. And then, that one and then oops that one and then you can go around your outer edge whoops let's do no that doesn't matter it is sunny today yay but the sun is coming in my window and now um where where it is I can't see anything <laughs> so hopefully I'm hopefully I am actually inking this properly who knows all right there you go so now it's all inked up and ready to go if you can see that all right and then you can just load it up with your goodies let's see I've got a tag and there's another tag here and then we can put this guy here. There you go. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful. Um, and like I said, this was not my idea. So go check out Pam at the Paper Outpost. Um, even if you, you know, you know how to do this now, that's fine, but go check out her other book page um, tutorials because I know I have a ton of book pages laying around and she has some really amazing ideas. Okay, guys, um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and hit that bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And I will talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.